With no calculator allowed, a quite neat way to do this is to write 5 to the 5 as 5 times 5 to the 4, and 4 to the 4 as 4 times 4 cubed, and 3 to the 3 as 3 times 3 squared, and 2 to the 2 as 2 times 2 to the 1. And Well, 1 to the 1 is 1, take away 1 to the 0 is 0, that cancels itself out. Now we have 5 times 5 to the 4, take away 1 times 5 to the 4, so that gives us 4 times 5 to the 4. We have 4 times 4 to the 3, take away 1 times 4 to the 3, which gives us 3 times 4 to the 3. We have 3 times 3 squared, take away 1 times 3 squared, which is 2 times 3 squared. And we have 2 times 2 to the 1, take away 1 times 2 to the 1, which gives us 1 times 2 to the 1. Now 4 times 5 to the 4, we can write 5 to the 4 is 5 squared squared, so that's 4 times 25 times 25. Add, well 3 times 4 is 12, and 4 squared is 16. Add, 3 squared is 9, times 2 is 18, and of course 1 times 2 is 2. 4 times 25 is 100, times 25, that gives us 2,500. Add, 192 is 12 times 16, add 18, add 12, that gives us 2,712, which is answer E.